will be in the top 12. Your results are revealed live on American Ice. These contestants are so close to the finals, they can taste it. But there is only room for 12. The country has voted, and the results are in. The drama is about to unfold, and anything can happen. This is American Idol. My name is Ryan Seacrest, and it is a very important night for us on American Idol. Down here, you can see a dozen empty seats. By the end of the hour, we will have filled them with your top 12. Next week, they will have a massive sound stage. They're going to have a huge studio audience and an even bigger band, plus a whole team of stylists at their disposal. Now, the judges. They don't have stylus, obviously. Say hi to him, though. Randy Jackson. No, Paula does. Paula, Paula does. Paula Abdul. And clearly he doesn't, Simon Cowell. The contestants knew it was the most important week of the competition so far, and so did you. 46 million votes were cast, ladies and gentlemen. Not bad. All because of these performances. Take a look. This week it was everyone's last chance as the girls and the guys battled to earn a spot in the top 12. Some stuck to what they knew best. Bucky chose country. Chris rocked it. Mandisa belted it. And Taylor was all sold. Taylor, this is what it's all about. It's about having fun and standing out. Feel the rhythm of the music Others tried something a little different. Do that kind of beat. It's always an interesting song choice. I was actually surprised you did that tonight. Find it hard to believe we're in heaven. But it was Will who split the panel. To be your love by just uh, was not good. Not I good totally for me. disagree with not you, Randy. Not good Randy. for me, Paul. Totally not disagree because. I'm the fan. Oh, sweet. <laughs> At least you've got the middle-aged vote, though. Oh. <laughs> For some of the other younger contestants, age played a major part. You know, 16 years old, you've got the whole package. You definitely are definitely an old soul in this competition. But it wasn't all positive. You've got to be a bit younger. Starry, starry night. It was very juvenile. Oh. How old are you? How old are you, Kevin? I'm 16 years old. No, that was more like 11. And in true Simon form, the childish banter continued. You know, I had a dream about you last night. I don't want to discuss yeah. whatever fantasy dreams you have about me on this oh. show. Oh. I mean, that's oh. like off camera. Do you, do you have? <laughs> Catherine attempted Aretha Franklin, the queen of soul. Ace tried his hand at Michael Jackson, the king of pop. And it suited the judges. So that was a risk, but you pulled it off. And you made it seem absolutely effortless. Thank you. I thought you did an incredible job. Um, your falsetto is amazing. Kelly broke her country ties and rocked out, causing a little confusion. Kelly, you are what's known as a naughty little minx. A naughty what? When Melissa tried to rock, Simon made a prediction. I think that right. last note booked your plane ticket home, sweetheart. Some people want it all, and Kanik got the same fortune. Once again, I think you have just booked your plane ticket oh. home. But, America, you've decided who really is going home. Your top 12 revealed 
tonight. The pressure is on, but before we get to the results, it is a pleasure to welcome the guy who breezed through like 14 shows just like this one without breaking a sweat once. His album, The Real Thing, is about to turn platinum. Ladies and gentlemen, say hello to Bo Bice. What's up, bro? Good you, man. Come on in, your old house. Yeah. Congratulations on everything. Thank you so much. And Bo is, uh, well, you can call him Big Papa now. You're a That's daddy. That's right, yeah. Tell us about being a dad. You know, it's the most incredible experience ever, Ryan. Just, um, not just to have him and hold him, but, um, you know, that's, uh, he'll be on, on stage here before too long. Do you yeah. sing to him? <laughs> yeah, every day. What every do you day I'm home. What do you like to sing to him? Well, uh, he loves Jim Croce and James Taylor and obviously Skinner. Yeah, of course. Yeah. No doubt. <laughs> How has uh, this show changed your life when you think back at everything? Well, I mean, um, the obvious thing, you know, people know who I am and yeah. come out to see gigs and stuff. But you had That's to move, great. didn't you? Yeah, we had to split, you know. It was like when people started showing up at the door from Florida and different places wanting pictures and, and stuff. Well, it because we weird, featured so. your home on one of the episodes yeah. and people tracked you down yeah. and they were camping out. And they're like, hey, we know he's in there. We saw the house on TV. <laughs> <laughs> well, good luck tonight. You're going to sing for us right now. What are you going to do? Let's do uh, let's do the single, the real thing. All right, and then of course is America voting, or we're we not going to do that with Bo. All right, so I think I'm going home. You're, you're safe, I think, regardless. Yeah. Bo Bice, everybody, take it away.
sweating, huh? <laughs> now you're working. Good job, man. Thanks for coming back. Always good to see you, bro. Okay, we got your results coming up next. What is happening? The top 12 tonight. We will name it. Stay with us live on American Idol. Welcome back to American Idol Live. Time to get down to business. The guys, they're upstairs in the red room. We will get to you very soon, gentlemen. With me down here, I have the eight girls going for the six available places in the top 12. Give it up for the ladies one more time. First of all, I'm going to name the girl with the lowest number of votes. Dim the lights. Good luck. Here we go. Starting with Lisa. You sang. Here's where I stand. Randy didn't think it was great. Paula thinks you have the whole package. Simon guaranteed you would sail through tonight. Lisa, you do not have the lowest number of votes. Okay, Melissa, here we go. You sang, what about love? Randy thought, it was the perfect song for you. Paula called you a force to be reckoned with. Simon disagreed and thought you would be going home tonight. Melissa, America voted. You do not have the lowest number of votes. Now we're over to Ayla. Ayla, you sang, unwritten. Randy is a fan. Paula gave you props for taking a risk and working hard. Simon wants you to be younger on stage. Ayla, America voted, and you do not have the lowest number of votes. <laughs> Kanik, you have the lowest number of votes and are leaving us tonight on American Idol. Come on up, darling. Join us in the center of the stage. Let's hear it for Kanik, ladies and gentlemen. That's the way it goes. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Are you surprised? Were you expecting it? What was going on? You know, in your you head? never know what to expect, but to have made it this far and accomplished so much in so many years that I've been trying to do this, there's no way that I can lose. I came out full fledged a winner. Well said. <laughs> and with Randy, I know you like Kanik. Any advice for her? She moves on. You got to keep working on it and keep believing in yourself. You know, it's about every time you hit the stage, it just needs to be the bomb every time. Okay. Can't let up once. Okay. Paula, sad to see her go. I am. I think you're a brilliant talent, and I think just better song selections next okay. time. I won't even risk it with Simon. <laughs> but we will ask you to sing one more time. Do you mind? Okay. <laughs> he won't say anything oh, nice. Oh, Trust oh. me, I've been here before. <laughs> Kanik, Ladies and gentlemen, nice to know you. Thank you. Sir. One more time for Kanik. Take it away. Some people live just for the pain Some people live for the power Some people live just to play the game Some people think that the physical things define what we think
so much. Thank you. You've been great. You look beautiful, too. Thank you. One more shout-out to your fans. Go ahead. What would you like to say to them? Oh, can I please? Yeah, please, please. Thank you so much to everybody back at home, Columbia, South Carolina, Duluth, Georgia. You guys have been incredible. I hope I did you proud. I love you, and I can't wait to see everybody. You're a very good speaker. Can you smile, everybody? All right, after the break, the guys are in the spotlight. Who will your vote send home first? We'll see you in a few, live on Idol. Welcome back to Idol Live. Very tense atmosphere in the studio here tonight. Your votes ended the journey for Kanique Sky and the rest of the girls up in the red room, nervously waiting to find out who else is going to be cut from their group tonight. I got the guys with me right now. Let's hear it for the gentlemen of American Idol. How you feeling? What have you said to each other before this show tonight? Ace? Just, we've gotten this far. I mean, there were 92,000 people that auditioned. So be proud of, of this thus far. Kevin? Yeah, I'm just proud. I'm proud to be here. I'm happy you nervous? To be here. Of course, without question. And Gideon, you're grinning. We should God expect bless that. Everybody. Now. Well, guys, it's the same drill. Good luck to you all. I'm looking for the guy who got the lowest number of votes last night. Dim the lights. Here we go. Kevin, you sang Vincent. Randy likes you. He likes that you can sing. Paula loved the ballad. Simon thought it was a juvenile performance that it will get the granny vote. Kevin, you do not have the lowest number of votes. Gideon, here we go, Gid. You sang, When a Man Loves a Woman. Randy thought it was a nice way to start off the show. Paula thinks you are a showman. Simon thought it was cabaret, but said you're growing on him. Gideon, America voted, and you do not have the lowest number of votes. <laughs> Bucky, right? Okay. Don't know where Rocky is right now. You sang Wave on Wave. Randy liked your country choice. Paula loves your raw, untapped talent. Simon thought it was okay. Bucky, America voted, and you do not have the lowest number of votes. <laughs> Elliot, here we go, bud. You sang Heaven. Randy liked your song choice. Paula thought it was phenomenal and amazing, but Simon thought it was a cop-out. Elliot, America voted. You do not have the lowest number of votes. <laughs> Will, you do have the lowest number of votes. Your journey ends tonight on American Idol. Let's hear it for Will, ladies and gentlemen. All right, man. Okay. Yeah, I'm fine. What, what does it feel like to have gone through all the audition process, all the hard work the last few weeks, the votes, and, and be here right now, not making it into that top 12? Well, it's pretty, you know, it's difficult, but at the same time, I got to sing for these three guys, and thank you so much for everything. And thank you to American Idol and everything. This has really been a great experience for anybody. You're I mean, a young I'm, guy. You're I'm only you're, 17. I was so. going to say, you're a young guy, you're very mature. Well, what have you learned? I mean, this is a, it's a class in life, being here on American Idol. What, what will you take away with yourself? Oh, well, I've learned so much with being with these guys and everything from Hollywood Week. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I feel like I've improved from the auditions to now a lot, a lot. Paula, you champion this young man. What do you have to say to him as he leaves us tonight? I'm very proud of him. Very proud of your girls. Very proud of the gentleman that you are and that you've become. Randy, what should he do? I mean, he's, he's got the momentum of American Idol. What's his next move? Got to work really hard, man, on your vocals and really discover who you are as a singer. I mean, and nail that every single time. Really discover that. Do a little discovery work. Simon, what do you think? Will, you know what? You handled yourself, as Paula said, like a gentleman, very mature for your age, and uh, whatever you go into with that kind of attitude, you're going to do well. I like you. Smart kid, Will. Thank you for being here. We're going to have you do it one more time. Is that cool? That's all right. Take it away. Ladies and gentlemen, Will McCarr. Needed the shelter of the 
someone's arms in their youth. And thank you, baby. Oh, oh, yeah. How sweet it is to be loved by you. Sweeter than a sugar now. How sweet it is to be loved by you. Oh, you were better to me than I was to myself. For me, there is you and there. And thank you, baby. Whoa, whoa, how sweet it is to be loved by you. Oh, no, no, baby, how sweet it is to be loved. How sweet it is, my baby. Thank you very much, Will. Show us some love, guys. Come on, hang on with me. All right, we are taking a break. When we come back, we start filling these seats with the top 12 live on American Idol. Stay tuned. Welcome back to American Idol Live. We have lost Kanik Sky and Will McCarr. We're now going to see how the results panned out for the rest of the girls. Let's do it, ladies. Starting with Paris. You sang Conga. Randy knows you have the talent, but didn't like the song choice. Paula liked the up-tempo song. Simon loved your enthusiasm, thinks America will love it too. Paris, you do not have the second lowest number of votes. <laughs> that means, Paris, you're in the top 12. Come on, guys. Take a seat. Congratulations, darling. One of those is for you. <laughs> Does that feel pretty good, Paris, sitting over there all alone? It do. Hurry up, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Next, Catherine. You sang Think. Randy thought it was a hot one. Paula compared you to a well-oiled machine. Simon said you're going to sail through. Catherine, America voted. Apparently, no surprise, you're in the top 12. Congratulations. Thank you. Go join Paris. Oh, gosh. Be careful in your heels. There you go. <laughs> Back on this side of the stage, the nerves, and Kelly Pickler. You sang, I'm the only one. Randy loved the song choice. Paula thinks you're getting better and better each week. Simon called you a minx yeah. and even prefers you to Carrie Underwood. Kelly, I know you ain't never been in the top 12 before, but you are I'm now. Yeah. Come on down here and take a seat. Congratulations. Join Paris and Catherine. Thank you. You picked Pickler for the top 12. <laughs> All right, Mandisa. Here we go, girl. You sang, I'm Every Woman. Randy thought it was the best female vocal this season. Paula got chills. Simon said it was brilliant. You know, he wanted to see you on a bigger stage. Remember him saying that? I do. He's going to get a chance to do it. <laughs> you have made it into the top 12. Mandisa, <laughs> over here. Congrats, babe. Celebrations over there with the seats and 
definitely intense on this side of the stage. Ladies, Lisa, you are the youngest contestant in the competition, and you are in the top 12. Okay, girls, go ahead and pick a seat. Sit down there. I know you do. I want you to take a look at this. We have two girls left over here on the couches. We have one seat to fill. That's where we're going to leave it for the moment. One of them is in, one of them is out. You'll find out who goes where after the break. Welcome back to American Idol Live. I have Melissa McGee and Ayla Brown with me right now for one. The competition continues for the other. It is the end of the line. Randy, who do you think will go on? It's a tough decision, but I guess I would probably at this moment have to pick Ayla to go on. You know, America has voted. Ayla, straight A student, great basketball player, true champ. Melissa, Took that first flight from Tampa to Denver to audition. Well, Melissa, that flight was worth it. You are into the top Congratulations. Which means Ayla, the journey ends for you tonight. Melissa, have a seat. Ayla. Okay, Donna. I know it's not easy. There's nothing fun about it, especially after all that hard work. But think about what you've been able to do. You know, think about all of the wonderful things you've been able to accomplish on the show, the fans that you've won over out there. Lots of people watched you, loved you, and voted, you know? So if you make it to this point, think of the thousands that line up, darling. All right? Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Lon. When, when you think back, think of all of the things you've been through. What has been the toughest and possibly the most valuable lesson that you can take away? The most valuable lesson for me personally has been to realize what's important in life. And um, I've learned a lot being out here, not necessarily, I mean, I've always worked hard in school and everything, but. Um, just knowing what's important and working hard for something that you're really passionate about. And um, I was really passionate about basketball, but, you know, equally as passionate about something like this, so. Hey, the brown man. Never cry. You know what? It's okay to cry because you care. It's okay to show that emotion. Listen. I, I want these three to have a chance to say something to you because you guys have certainly bonded and, and almost become friends. Randy, what would you like to say to Ayla as she leaves us tonight? Good luck, man, and keep working hard because you got a winner spirit. So this is just the beginning. You got to remember that. It's just the beginning. And if you're really as passionate as you say you are, you do it. It'll happen. Yes. Paula? You're a winner, Ayla. You're a winner in everything that you've proven so far. You keep going. You keep going for your dreams. People like you and the spirit and the whole blueprint of your whole life is waiting for you. It's out there for you to change and do whatever you want. Simon? Yeah, Ayla, you know, it was the song. It wasn't you, it was the song. It happens, you know? Like Randy said, you're a winner. You've got to hold your head up. Yeah. Well, we're going to ask you to sing for us uh, one more time, OK? Thank you very much. Ayla Brown, ladies and gentlemen. Take it away, Ayla.
Thank you very much, Ayla. Ayla Brown, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, darling. I'm going to ask you to step right down there. Good luck, sweetheart. Gentlemen, back to you now. Whew, what a night. You've been sweating it out. Let's get to it, all right? Your turn. We'll find out who else is going home. Let's start with Taylor. You sang, taking it to the streets. Randy liked the song choice for you. Paula loved your performance and dance steps. Simon thought it was the best performance of the night. Taylor, America agreed with Simon. You're in the first row. Dance across that stage. Let's move, let's move, let's show it. Ace, you ready? Ready. You sang Butterflies. Randy liked the falsetto. Paula thought it was incredible. Simon, however, thought the vocals were not great. Ace, America voted. You are in the top 12. Chris, here we go. You sang Broken. Randy liked your rocking out again. Paula thinks you are an amazing artist, but Simon was not impressed, thought it was boring. Chris, America voted, and you are going to join the others in the top 12. Oh! Back and compete to be the next American Idol. Oh. Not a boy. Take a seat. Oh. Kevin. You know, you've been labeled everything from uh, Chicken Little to a sex symbol here on American Idol. Simon thinks you are too young. Kev, America disagrees with Simon. You're in the top 12, buddy! Take a seat! Elliot, you survived the judges' comments and the anger of the Brittenham twins. Remember that? <laughs> I do. Yes, I do. <laughs> Where, where'd you guys come from? The moon? Yeah. Look like you've been spacewalking, like moon suits. Shocker. They're talking. I'm rich. <laughs> Elliot, it was all worth it, my man. You're in the top 12. Man. Get on down here. Good work, buddy. Enjoy. Take a seat. There are two guys left and only one seat available. Who will make it? We're going to let you know live after the break. Welcome back to American Idol Live. Bucky Covington and Gideon McKinney. Look like either one of them could pass out if I don't get to the results soon. Simon, who did America put through in your opinion? I think they would have put Gideon through. You think it's Gideon? Yeah. Gideon, the grin has always been a factor on the show. Bucky came from painting cars in North Carolina to this stage. That's it. America voted. Bucky, we're going to see you back here next week. You're into the Congratulations. Congrats, buddy. Have a seat. Thank you very much.
which means Gideon leaves us tonight right here and still smiling about it. How you feel, Gideon? He's smiling the blood of Jesus, I'm saved. Are you surprised? I am surprised, but... What would you like to say to your fans who voted for you, Gideon? Fans, thank you. God bless you. I love you. Pray for me. Thank you. This is not the end. This is just the beginning. Yeah. Want to sing for us one more time? Yeah. Kenny McKinney, ladies and gentlemen. Kenny. Come on up. Let's hear it for him. Kenneek Sky, Anna Brown, Lou McCarr, and of course, Gideon. Those leaving us tonight, a tough, tough night for everybody. And we're definitely going to miss all of you. Have a look at some of your finest moments here on Idol. Watch this. For me, this could and I believe will be a pivotal moment in my life. You never would guess, ever, that you'd make it this far, even if you're one of the most talented people in the world. I always had this plan of what I was going to do with my future, and now it's just all up in the air. From the time I was 12 years of age, I've had dreams, I've had visions about seeing myself walking to that audition room. I really feel that I'm walking into my destiny. In my heart, that's what my spirit is telling me, is that I truly am walking into what I'm supposed to be doing. The ride has just been incredible. I don't know what's coming next or where to go. Don't mess with Texas. Yeah! For me, 100% yes. Welcome to Hollywood! Oh, yeah! Gideon is on his way to Hollywood. Yeah, Gideon! Hollywood, California, here I come, baby! always been my dream just to show America what I have. You're kind of growing on me a bit. I hate to see you guys go. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have got to make room for that top 12. Your top 12, and here they are. Man, Lisa. Chris Daughtry. <laughs> Melissa McGee. Bucky Covington. <laughs> Kelly Pickler. <laughs> Elliot Yamin. <laughs> Harris Bennett. <laughs> Taylor Hicks. <laughs> Catherine McPhee. <laughs> Kevin Coveas. <laughs> Lisa Tucker. And Ace Young. 
<laughs> These are your finalists, America! <laughs> they get the big stage, they get the huge studio audience, and you get the chance to make one of them a superstar. We will be back with a live two-hour special on Tuesday, jamming to the music of Stevie Wonder. Thank you to the judges for tonight. Thank you to Ricky Minor and the band, as always. Great to see you. Stay tuned. But I'll do OC coming up next. I've been Ryan Seacrest. Good night. And say hello to the American Idol. They're here somewhere.